I uh, gotta say though, this was this kind of got so my this got yeah. my appetite yeah, going. Just, oh hey, yeah, yeah. I'm when, just gonna uh, say, my Jaquan Hardy is the, eating. Well, not only that, they did a, they did a double double segment where they have ja, uh, J- Jaquan Hardy, uh, and then they go over to Micah Parsons and his mom making the food. Okay, and then what? a and then a boss game of Connect Four. And that if I wasn't setting up for four hours, I was gonna have a Connect Four thing. Up front there, that Anthony and Steve, we're going to have to have a quick game of Connect Four. <laughs> I mean, look. It, it, I so like that they ha- that he has the, all the, all the defense. I think the defense over to his mom's place to have some oh, home. Some like, that looks some good fucking That looks so good. I mean, so, that's, clax- that's classic Texas right there. Did, yeah. What did, was it? Mac and cheese, biscuits, and, oh, yeah. and, and fried chicken? Yeah. It yeah. looks like some. Love it. Looks fucking delicious. Are we are we gonna have that for uh, while we watch the game this Thursday? I think oh, that that'd be good. I, um, Michael Parson. Yeah, we should get some. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Some of that. Some fried chicken and Ma- some baked uh, some baked mac and soul cheese. food. Shit, yeah. Soul food. M- Mike or uh, Michael Parsons just talks, talks, talks. Hey, like yeah, like I mean, he'd probably be a r- one. I I know the type of friend that he would be, and. Uh, you know, you'd love him and hate him at the same time. <laughs> he's the type of guy I think it's like when you first meet him, you're like, I don't fucking like this guy. But then he's just he's legit, and that's who he is. He who he is. So it's like okay, you just grow to love him. And, and the fact that he's damn good really helps as well. But yeah, he had everyone over. They're all eating food. It was just a real again. It's that wholesome. Well, and we just and we also know that Leighton Va- crack me if you got him. We also know that Leighton Van Der Esch sucks at Connect Four. Period. Yeah, right. He what a looks st- terrible. Like, get the fuck out of here! Yeah, fuck out of here. Um, like I felt that, like Michael you Parsons. You need to be able to count to four to put <laughs> Fuck! I can't get past two. <laughs> Look at him. He's like, oh shit. Oh dang. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just skipping through. I don't think there's much else. There was there. like a clip of Dak showing that he was ready and he was ki- he was ripping up the defense and Amari Cooper burning some guys. But the 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 gist of the uh, episode is basically who's getting cut. We already know. So vamos, we- señor. Or no, gracias, señor. Gracias, more- señor. Al Al mom is M- more just importantly fucking- than hard knocks. Like we got Tampa coming up this week. Mm. Before yeah. we even dive into that, how happy and how fucking sweet is it that football's back? Like next Sunday, there's. There's gonna be football on Dude, all fucking. And day. we get 17 weeks this year, or 17 games, I should say. Yeah, uh, eight, 18, 18 weeks, 17 Ooh, games. Yeah, it's gonna be. Oh, here we go. You got you got that little preview going on here. Well, uh, but pauses for Weiss, a second. Wives around the world are gonna be shocked when the season does, ends um, pa- two weeks later. <laughs> just shit. just pause it for a sec. The one quote that Mike McCarthy said is that he can't wait to get. Uh, more genuine in the locker room uh, after the Hard Knocks crew leaves. Yeah, like McCarthy it, eager to be more genuine. And I think that's it's, – it's smart. Like, the last thing you want as a – I mean, any coach, but especially second-year coach of the Dallas Cowboys is to say something – that um, it's gonna get taken out of context exactly or... and, and and like leave that to jerry jones yeah. <laughs> well i mean Wait, like, are, you, oh, are you saying it, there's some words that he didn't say because he's on camera okay yeah probably i mean or just like he wants to like look is he gonna get canceled <laughs> possibly <laughs> well if he's talking about being genuine i'm i'm guessing that he's probably he's probably wanting to just get more vulnerable vulnerable uh with it <laughs> you know like take his shirt off yeah Hey guys, you don't mind if I go top tar- t- tarps off for this one, do you? Tarps off for the cowboys. How about them cowboys? Actually, that's he has no accent. He's, he's going, he's going, no. he's going skins, but tops on bottoms off. But, oh, okay, I like it. <laughs> okay, but what what I was getting at is, I think, uh, well, one, I, I think that it could. I, I get why they pick the cowboys for this uh, hard knock season, but do you? If it wasn't the Cowboys, what team would we have rather been watching during uh, the Cowboys? Raiders. Because let's, let's just be honest. As as great as it has been, I would have rather have seen uh, Double J invest into their own YouTube team, putting out week to week episodes uh, on their own Dallas Cowboys YouTube channel. Because I you, think we you, probably would have seen wait, a lot think, more stuff that think, we wouldn't like. Do you think Jerry Jones paid to have Hard Knocks? No, with the Cowboys this season. No, no, no who because chooses that? well, I, I I think NFL Films does, and then yeah. it's in the NFL, and I think because they had such a hard. Uh, season last season and Dak coming back, they figured that the storylines would be really present. Right. But I think like just what we're seeing is if you look at the Bucks YouTube channel or the Jets or even the Browns, the Browns got one. Yeah. All, all of them are producing unbelievably it, quality content that like yes. you don't need I, I and the cut storyline. Exactly, you can actually just follow your your stars. Yep, and you mm-hmm. know pe- people would rather tune into something where you're seeing more of a Zeke. 
yeah. Dak. Yeah, rather than watching yeah, the... It's, yeah, okay. It's, okay. All, yeah. it's all wrapped up in an NFL package, so it's not like, oh, we're going to get more in-depth... Um, Who would have thought the Browns could produce quality content? <laughs> <laughs> Who 